subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for the latest updates. What's up people out there? This is Ashish Johan from Ashi Recreation. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you all guys are doing extremely well. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can edit your pre-wedding photographs in beautiful, beautiful Lightroom. So before getting to the video, just press the like button on this video so that it will motivate me to make more videos and presets just like this for you guys. And if you still haven't subscribed to our channel, then do subscribe and hit the notification icon to get latest updates. Also visit our website that is www.asperegrations.com From there you can download backgrounds, camera operation, Lightroom preset, LUTs, PNGs and every other photo editing stuff just for free. <coughs> also follow me on Instagram. Let's jump to the beautiful world of Lightroom. <coughs> now let's import the photograph which you want to edit. Click on the import button. Let's browse the... <coughs> photo which you want to get uh, to be edited now let's select this photograph go to the import <coughs> sorry for that just click on this and go to the develop tab now let's this is our raw image now here we will just uh, edit the photograph the very first thing we need to do is let's add some contrast on the image <coughs> reduce some highlights from the image because it is totally overexposed so we gonna just reduce it now let's just increase some shadows from the image let's reduce some whiteness to minus 5 here let's increase the blackness To plus 50 because you want your photograph to be you know more bright enough so you need to do this <coughs> now let's go to the calibration tab just move this cursor from to minus 17 and just increase the saturation of this to plus 40 <coughs> go to that SL tab now from here let's just uh, select the ready stone and just make it to more yellowish and here just increase the luminescence because it will you know brighten up the tone you can see the difference we will increase the saturation from here now from here let's just add some orange tone increase the luminescence go to the hue <coughs> now here we gonna just uh, make it more aqua just uh, turn the green to aqua stone or autumn down whichever you want you can just use it but aqua tone is looking very much perfect so just move it to aqua color and just aqua color too minus here let's just increase the saturation of this color again let's just select the blue color and here also we'll increase the saturation of this one now here let's just add some graduate graduated filter so select this one
and let's add some kind of color tones to the image let's add this yellow tone because it will look like you know sunshine sunlight is just passing from here so add a little bit of contrast reduce some highlights this is how you can just add you know sunlight on the images let's give it a done <coughs> let's add one more graduated filter from below here let's just make it to teal color just a little bit and just give it a done <coughs> now again let's select this uh, radial filter and we will just add a perfect uh, light on this side and just hit ok done <coughs> let's select this adjustment brush one click on here and then just uh, pump out the yellow tone and just give it done now let's just go to the split toning now let's we will add some kind of shadows on the image so let's just pick any of the shadows let's pick this blue shadow here just make the saturation to around 15 percent and let's add the highlights that would be the what do you say yellow is looking very much perfect i guess so let's add these yellow highlights on the image just a little bit to around plus 25 would be pretty much perfect <coughs> now if you want to add some kind of you know vignette on the image you can add otherwise it is pretty much perfect i don't think there is need of adding the vignette just keep it as it is or if you want to give it a dreamy look you can add this white vignette but i don't want to give so just keep it as it is and here we will just increase the green saturation to plus 5 or plus 10 and red to plus 5 this will make your subject to look way more better and just 
u to minus 7 or minus 10 so finally here we have edited our photograph with uh, huge color, color, uh, color adjustment and your photograph is really looking amazing you want to see the before and after here was the before and here is the after now if you want to save this image right click on it and select uh, export and just give it a export click on the export button and you will automatically save the image now you can see the difference your photograph is really looking very much amazing here is the before and here is the after a huge difference can be seen from a normal photo to a very amazing edited photo which one is really looking perfect <coughs> So guys you can just do your editing process just like this and which will make your pre-wedding photograph to move to a next level from a normal raw images to a very impressive you know colorful green and aqua green tone this you can like this you can just edit your photograph <coughs> so guys thank you for watching and i hope you like the video and if you like the video then just press the like button on this video so that it will motivate me to make more videos and presets just like this for you guys and if you still have not subscribed to our channel then do subscribe and hit the notification icon to get latest updates also visit our website that is www.aspergreasons.com from there you can download backgrounds camera preset lightroom preset and every kind of photo editing stuff just for free also follow me on instagram let's so guys thank you for watching and bye bye till the next video